just want to do a quick video on this article for June um, of a Reader's Digest. It's called The Most Trusted People in America. And there's a hundred people that they designated um, that are basically trusted Americans. And I'm just going to go through them really quick because I only have um, a little bit of time and on here because the battery's running down. Um, number one, they start with Tom Hanks, which um, is allegedly, supposedly, has African American in him and has denied it all of his career. And he's um, played homosexual roles and it supports uh, the homosexual marriages. So, of course, he's number one. And we got Sandra Bullock, who was married to a racist. Um, this is a, supposedly a, a, a Satanist witch, allegedly. And she's number two. Then we have, um, I'm going to go through these really quick. Denzel. Who's um, allegedly a sellout actor who sold his soul and is reportedly on tape talking about it. And we've got Meryl Street, um, Maya Angelou, Steven Spielberg, who supports homosexual agenda, um, Bill Gates, who's supposedly involved in genocide of uh, people, and his wife. And then we've got um, Julia Roberts, supposedly a witch of Hollywood, allegedly, and Alex Trebek. And so you're seeing kind of like the theme here. It's typically the, the same type of person. we got Robert. Um, he's a Nobel Peace Prize chemist. Robin uh, Roberts is a homosexual anchor woman. Um, we know Clint Eastwood has supported homosexuality. Um, there's usually a, um, a theme that they're all pretty much acceptance of the New World Order agenda. And of course we've got Ellen here. Um, Jimmy Carr, we, they have a president. We've got mostly media. Um, one diplomat. Um, and we got Michelle Obama, 19, and, um, it looks like Ellen beat out Michelle, and then we have over here the doctors, Judge Judy, so it's either a doctor, professor, or media, or sports figures, who they, um, and they've got Rachel Ray, they gave her the 31 Illuminati number. And Colin Powell. And um, Johnny Depp is supposedly a known alleged um, satanic person. Barbara Walters has admitted a lot of fears. She supports homosexual agenda. Um, so it's either you got to be either an athlete, a judge, or a media person or a Nobel Peace Prize winner, professor, um, and we got Whippy who's known for kissing people, um, Ali, we know he's, and, um, look at this, Hillary Clinton's supposed to be coming out, bisexual, it's a pretty typical list. But you can always guess with who's going to be on there, you know. The same, same people. Same typical. So these are who we're supposed to trust and believe that um, they're not going to lie to us and they sell the products to us. And I guess Adam Sandler even beat out Obama. A spot... And then we got, um, most of these people all are down for the homosexual agenda. They don't, aren't, any of them aren't known Christians. Look, even Cameron Diaz made the list. 
and um, and then we know about his accusations. He's on the list still. Comedian. This guy had domestic violence. He still made it. This New World Movement people. Of course, they're always there. And um, Forbes people. They put their self on the list. And always the moguls. And who does this list? Um, they probably make it up themselves. So they're just talking about politicians and then the people that they normally look to. And this is the type of complexion and... You know, brunettes are more regarded as genuine, but mostly everyone on the list is pretty much blonde. A bunch of them talks about the traits, you know, that they look for, the brands. So this is information you need. Just bringing it to you, just looking at these people and, and just shaking my head, wondering... How come there's not one Christian on this list? Information you need, all one word with the U. And notice how they say, In Tom we trust not in God. So now they're putting him up as a God. I mean, this is really sad. 